All right, thanks a lot, guys. Everything was excellent. <laughs> All right, man, see ya. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Sure. Yes. Oh, how did it work? <laughs> All right, see ya. I hate the awkward handshake. <laughs> you go for one handshake and then you do something totally wrong. I think I want to get a haircut. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get a haircut. All right, got that done. Inside the leaves? Mm. Oh, it's good. <laughs> Try standing on it. No. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> How was that? <laughs> Just doing a little time lapse here. This is the Navisink River in Seabright. And then I'm gonna head down a little further, probably get some more footage. Maybe go in the park there too. Really nice there. so I can get a nice long ride all the way down. It's like the perfect weather today. It's not too hot, not too cold. The sun is finally out. It's like the sun is always hiding. I just want it to stay like this all the time. Ooh, it's getting a little steeper. <laughs> started wobbling a little bit <laughs> if I were to have to jump off I would have definitely just fell <laughs> Very nice. So this is the rock form case for my Galaxy S5. And this is the GoPro mount that attaches to the case. Um, I don't wanna show you too much of it because I'm gonna save that for the review. Uh, this is a vlog, so I don't wanna you know, go into all the details of that. So rock form was nice enough to send that to me to do a review, so I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Uh, it seems like a really cool mount, so I can't wait to try it out. I'm not sure if you guys ever use this website called Social Blade. It's, um, it's a site that gives you like statistics of your YouTube channel, like how many views you get, how many subscribers. I'm sure many of you probably heard of it, but they have this new feature called Live Statistics. And I'm on PewDiePie's uh, Social Blade page. And Live Statistics basically updates every two seconds and you can see how quick his subscribers go up and his views. It's really weird because it goes up, but then sometimes it goes down. So it's kind of like the stock market. <laughs> Six, 161. And then let's see if it goes up. It already went up 20 from like the past 
like two minutes that I've been looking at this. It's really crazy because last year around this time, my channel was mostly, you know, I was just doing like tutorials, GoPro tutorials. Uh, I didn't really do reviews or anything like that. And I didn't do any vlogs either. So I'm just starting to get, you know, into the reviews. I just started doing that recently. Uh, but the vlog, like my channel since last year around this time, I had, I think about either 1500 or 2000 subscribers. And now I think I'm a little over 5,700, which is good enough for me. I mean, I think as long as it's going up and not down, you know what I mean? I just want to say thanks a lot to all you guys that subscribed and watched my videos, either the vlogs, the reviews, or tutorials, and like the videos and leave comments because that really makes me happy. So thank you so much for doing that. And I just want to talk about like why I vlog. I kind of look at it as a, a journal or a diary. So you basically I could capture what I do each day whenever I vlog. And if I want to in the future is go back to the day and see what I did exactly on that day. Like a diary is a little different because you can almost think of a diary and a vlog kind of like a movie and a book. If you watch a movie and read the book to that movie, the movie is going to be a lot different than the book because the book can explain a lot more things like what the character is feeling or their emotions or, you know, so a vlog is a little different than a, a personal diary, but um, I'm not really too into writing, so I love capturing things, so that's why the vlog fits perfect for me. Try out vlogging. I think it's pretty cool just capturing what you did. Now, I don't say, I'm not saying you have to upload it to YouTube or anything like that. That's just... You know an added plus sharing it with other people and you know hopefully they enjoy uh, watching what you do now you can't really please everybody because that's impossible you're not gonna make everybody happy with things that you upload onto YouTube it's just that's just the way it is you know so um, just do it for yourself but if you like just put it on YouTube also from 10 years from now I could go back and see exactly what I did on August, uh, not August, on April 28th, 2015. Hopefully YouTube's still around and they don't delete all my videos because that would definitely suck. French fry. Mm. Real hot. <sighs> The salad. It's arugula? Yeah, it's a wash. That's yeah, good like this. Thanks. Oh. Mm. Onion? Oh yeah, onion. Forgot about the onion. The tomato you put? No. I didn't see any fire, so maybe it was just a close call. Hopefully everybody's okay. Uh, but I'm heading home now. The clouds are looking pretty cool. I don't know, I'm thinking about maybe getting some more time-lapse done. I really wanna get um, get a nice time-lapse of the stars. Oh, these are a lot of bumps. Ugh, too many potholes. Do a nice little star-lapse. So maybe I'll do that tonight. Oh, that's a good shot. I'm so mad I missed the sunset. I only missed it by like 10 minutes. Um, so today's kind of like a time-lapse day. I don't know, I was just kind of into doing that today because I have that intervalometer. So now I can finally go out now that it's warm and shoot some time lapses. I'm doing one right now, this sweet looking tractor. Look at it. The shot was a nice a lot nicer before because the clouds were like pink. Um, but I guess you'll see it in like two seconds. Two, one, check it out. Yeah. 